I'm going to show you how to make these easy conversation heart boxes. All you're going to need is some pastel colored cardstock paper, scissors, a pencil, a ruler, a marker, and some hot glue. So to start, we're going to take our heart shaped template and trace this out onto our colored paper. And I just searched heart shaped template on Google and printed one off. And you can size it to however big you want to make your heart shaped box. Then we're just going to cut out our heart shape and you're going to need two per box. And you can use whatever color cardstock paper you would like. I just use a pastel pink for this example. Using some of the scrap paper, I'm cutting out some strips of paper that are a little over an inch. And these are going to form the sides of the box. And you're going to need about two strips of paper per side of the box. So two for the bottom and two for the top. Then you're going to take a marker and write whatever thing you want on one of your paper hearts. And I just put XOXO on this one because it's the easiest thing to write. And this is going to be the lid for your box. So just flip it over and then take some hot glue to glue on the strips of cardstock paper. And these are going to form the sides for the box. So I started from the center of the top of the heart and then glued around. So you're going to want to bend the corner at the bottom of the heart and then you will most likely need to attach a second strip of paper. It will just depend on how big your heart box is. So for mine, I just simply hot glued on another strip of paper and kept going all the way around the heart. And once you get all the way around the heart, go ahead and trim off any excess paper and then glue the two ends together. And you're going to do the exact same process to make the bottom of the box. You just want to glue the strips of paper a little bit further away from the edge so that the lid of the box will fit over top of it. And here's what it looks like all put together. These little heart boxes are fun to make for family and friends, and here's a few examples of what I put inside of mine. So in this purple one, I put some chocolates. And then in this pink one, I put some homemade sugar cookies and some heart-shaped chocolates. And finally, in this blue one, I put some chocolate-covered wafer cookies. And that's how you can make these super easy conversation heart boxes. I think they're super cute and a quick and easy last minute DIY that you can make for your loved ones and fill with their favorite treats and goodies. Thanks for watching!